Pero yun nga lang, sabihan nyo yung Amerikana, kayo, halata masyado user kayo. Ma maisip lang nyo kami kapag uh, gusto mo na mag-report sa Amerika eh. So, si Bato, galit sa inyo. Magpapalabasan na lang tayo dito ng sama ng loob. Dahil nga, <laughs> uh, pag, uh, pag uh, dumating yung pambubuli ng China, tayo galit na galit sa China, wala tayo ibang iniisip kung kanino tayo hingin ng tulong. And the closest ally that we can think of is Amerika. Di ba? Dapat silang tutulong sa atin. Uh, ngayon, ito lang mga Amerika, marami mga previous incidents na pinapangrapan rin tayo, ginigipit rin tayo. Uh, like for example, yung nasight kanina ng ating isang resource speaker during marami policies, yung procurement namin sa PNP ng uh, rifles, hinarang ng Amerika. Hindi sila tumulong. Ginamit, nagamit sana namin yun sa Marawi Seeds. Ngayon, mag-ingat tayo paano tayo magamit at magpagamit sa kanila. At the same time, kung magpagamit tayo, dapat magamit rin natin sila. Hindi dapat one way. Hindi to dapat one way na maalala lang namin ang Pilipinas kayo ngayong may problema sa Taiwan na may problema sa Taiwan, pwede pa lang gamitin na launching uh, pad yung itong northern na uh, Luzon para sa counter-attack natin doon sa sa Taiwan. Kung na-invade ang Taiwan by China, pwede magamit ang Pilipinas. Eh, ito kung mga Amerikano rin dapat, ipaparating rin nyo, sir, kayo naman nag-uusap palagi. Kayo man nag-uusap, parating rin nyo na uh, kaya yung mga tao minsan nagkagiging negative sa inyo dahil lumalabas na parang user kayo. Yung sir kayo, magagamit lang kayo pag kailangan nyo kami. Pero panahon ng kinakailangan kayo, hindi mo kayo tumutulong. Pero the fact remains, the fact remains, kahit na may, meron tayong ganong hinanakit sa kanila. The fact remains, na sila pa rin ang kinakailangan talaga natin kapag tayo binubuli ng China. Wala tayo ibang mapuntahan, kundi Amerika. Uh, yun lang. Okay bang bawi ko sir? Okay ba? Bumawi ako kunti? Okay lang? Ha? <laughs> gusto, gusto mo na mag-report sa Amerika eh. So, si Bato, galit sa inyo. Parang gano'n eh. Pero, wala pa wala tayo ibang pupuntahan kundi Amerika, di ba? Galit na galit na sa pambubuli ng China. Kanino tayo hingi ng tulong? Amerika. Di ba? Pero, yun nga lang, sabihan nyo, yung Amerikana, kayo, halata masyado user kayo. Ma maisip lang nyo kami kapag uh, may looming threat dyan sa Taiwan na nagdagdagan nyo, halata masyadong move ninyo eh, na gusto nyo, Northern Luzon, lagyan ng uh, additional edka sites. Uh, yun lang, mas maganda yung, kaya siguro negative yung ibang tao doon sa Northern Luzon sa kanila dahil kulang sila sa information na operation na unahan sila ng China. Baka China nandun na, nag-advance na doon, nag nangangampanya na yung China doon sa Northern Luzon na hindi ako, nagbibiro lang ako, gobyerno, ra, wala, wala, wala yan. Wala yan, Gob. Ang akin lang, eh, ba't ang Amerika, klaruhin nila yung purpose na dito, na hindi kami mam gagamit sa inyo. Hindi kayong gagamit sa inyo. Wala kaming, uh, kung ano, gamitin kayo, na uh, pagkatapos gamitin kayo, iiwan namin kayo. O, dapat walang ganunan. Uh, yun lang, Gob, uh, hindi, hindi ko, kung ano yun, Gob, ha, na, pinapasaya ko lang yung kwan dito ngayon, yung mood dito, kaya masyadong seryoso yung na uh, aming hearing dito. Yun lang sir, rin natin yung sa Amerika na ganun. Huwag nyo kami masyadong gamitin. At uh, alam nyo, we are also thinking mamalya. Ayaw rin na may mapapagamit ng uh, uh, kami mapapasubo. Yun lang sir. Thank you, thank you. Sir. Thank you, Madam Chair. Dun sa line of questioning and thinking aloud ko kanina, na if the situation in the region escalates, will our islands in the West Philippine Sea be secure? Kahit kung sa US mas priority nila yung ibang bahagi ng Asia, kaya nila ginagawa itong sa EDCA. Pero tayo, kung priority natin yung security ng mga isla natin sa West Philippine Sea, kalayaan, ayungin at iba pa. So isn't it time for us to consolidate in the West Philippine Sea? Bukod pa sa EDCA, Madam Chair. Salamat sa Madam Chair at Senderoy. Yes, thank you. Um, if you'd like to respond, I'll thereafter recognize uh, Senator uh, De La Rosa as well as Dr. Sasot. Thank you. Thank you, Madam Chair. Huh? Oh, Mama, uh, uh, on the suggestion of uh, ma, 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 uh, uh, Your Honors, uh, Madam Chairman, uh, on the suggestion of uh, Senator uh, Risa uh, on multilateralism, uh, actually, yan, yan, mama, ano, yan ang may be way, 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 way forward natin. Considering that we, only, we, we have only two, ano, two countries that we have BFA, and we we are exploring for the possible 
uh, Japan na uh, reciprocal access agreement. And hopefully, uh, nag-sign na po tayo ng TOR sa HIDR. And that will be our no, our jumping board for us to, no, to have uh, that bilateral agreement. And later on, maybe we can increase that. As we have, no, we have, uh, have um, uh, different dialogues, uh, uh, different ASEAN and also uh, Pacific dialogue. Uh, it has been, you know, it has been proven that uh, trilateral, uh, trilateral, trilateral uh, cooperation or quadrilateral uh, cooperation is more manageable than multilateralism. That's why we are exploring the possibility of having a trilateral agreement with the U.S. and uh, and uh, Australia because we have the BFA, and later maybe we can have a. Uh, uh, the RAA with uh, Japan, and considering also that uh, Japan is our uh, major, uh, major strategic partner in terms of uh, both uh, on uh, HIDR and also in uh, in, uh, in economic uh, partnership, uh, we are really, you know, re we are really driving at uh, the possibility of really expanding those alliances together with South Korea and other like-minded countries like uh, Indonesia, Malaysia, and ASEAN. And we have, uh, we have uh, uh, told them that uh, our centrality is ASEAN centrality. And uh, we have exposed to them that uh, our trilateral agreement with Indonesia, Malaysia have paid a successful uh, agreement wherein we have a joint patrols in the Sulu Sea and Celebacy that we were able to protect our common interests in the common zones. And that's the reason why that uh, we are uh, uh, having some sort of uh, bilateral uh, balikatan exercises. Balikatan exercises doesn't only on the land. It's also on the air and uh, Navy to Navy engagement. And uh, uh, joint patrols is one of our uh, area of exploration, considering that we have very, very effective on joint patrols in 2014, uh, together with Australia. And also uh, we have a uh, US uh, joint patrols so that we can show the flag in those uh, 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 territorial waters and also in our uh, EEZ uh, waters. So that's the main uh, main, you know, main objective of uh, of the you know the uh, joint patrol, so that we can show our flag that uh, that you know, that uh, that right is ours. And uh, lastly, on this point, Madam Chair, uh, although arguable na. Well, yeah, mas manageable lang tri or quadrilateral kaysa multilateral security arrangements. Yes. Pero given yung pag-flesh out ni Sec. Charlie about these possibilities, baka pwede rin nating pag-isipan i-accelerate yung pag-generate ng ganyang mga dagdag at uh, mas uh, at broader na mga multilateral or security arrangements yes. at baka pwedeng mag-menor magpreno ng konte yeah. dun sa EDGA. Ito ang mas bilisan, pwedeng magmenor dito sa dagdag EDGA size. Just a thought, Madam Chair. We, 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 we will look at that, Madam. Yes, thank you very much. Thank you very much. I think, uh, unfortunately, Secretary Manalo needs to leave. I think you wanted to do a final statement. Is there a concluding uh, response? Oh. Uh, I think he needs to leave. Well, can we just I, I, no, make I can, him? No, five minutes. I can. I, yes. I can. Yes. Okay. Sec Wait. Uh, nalito na ako. Teka. Yes, Bo. So Where do we go? Okay, Risa. Agyama na, Madam Chair. Just a quick question. Um, Governor Mamba maybe... also has raised his hand. And actually on the roster is really Sasot. <laughs> Uh, in any case, Senator Risa. In case the SEC would like to include this in his closing remarks, uh, how can the Philippines pursue a more multilateral approach to resolving security concerns in the region? Salamat, SEC. Agyamanak, Madam Chair. Thank you. Thank you, Madam Chair. My, my apologies. I, I have to uh, leave very soon to um, attend to the visit of... Uh, PM Anwar, who's, arrived, who's uh, going to meet the president this afternoon. Um, uh, uh, first, on the on the uh, on the query of uh, Senator Antiveros, yes, I think precisely that is the approach we're taking now: uh, multilateral, which uh, um, cooperation, uh, not only in terms of let's say multi, but even tripartite or joint, with a number of our partners. It's already been stated at the last visit of the of the president's visit to Japan. We also uh, uh, entered into talks with Japan on how we can enhance uh, defense cooperation with Japan. And Japan is certainly taking, in our view, a more active role now um, in the region. And we think it's a really a very good opportunity to explore 
how we can build up on our cooperation, not only in terms of military cooperation, but also on economic and uh, other areas where we can enhance our security. So that's being done with Australia. We're also uh, very much in touch now with Australia. And in terms of um, our ASEAN partners, we're also in talks with Singapore. And uh, we will also embark on discussions with uh, Vietnam and other countries in the region, all with the intention of trying to uh, increase our our, um, our security, not only in terms of military and defense, but also through economic security. So that's definitely the approach that we are adopting now, and and uh, as well as, of course, with traditional partners like the United States. Um, I just wanted, Madam Chair, just to say uh, last points on the on our discussion on on EDCA. What I can simply say is that on EDCA of the existing five projects. Um, uh, a number of them already include uh, humanitarian and, and uh, disaster relief uh, projects. So that's very much in sight. Um, what I just wanted to stress that when it comes to the EDCA, uh, our, main, our main control really lies on the fact that any, any, uh, any project or any kind of location will have to be agreed upon between the by mutual agreement. So that our control uh, lies on where it's located and also on the projects. Any kind of project will also have to be uh, on, uh, on the basis of mutual agreement. So I think uh, in that sense, there is uh, control over some of the other aspects of, of, the, of the agreement. But I just wanted to add that uh, uh, by saying that uh, we do have control, especially in the most important parts, location and the nature of the project. Thank you. Yes, thank you very much, uh, Secretary Manalo, and thank you for participating in this extended uh, executive session hearing today. Uh, certainly, we'd uh, like to look at uh, possible amendments to the EDCA, given that it's uh, due for extension April next year. Thank you. Narito ang inyong mga comments sa ating mga video. At po ng newsflash video ay makikita sa aking newsflash playlist. Sa mga gusto naman po ng mga biblical topics, punta po kayo sa aking channel na Mahafri TV. Para sa mga gustong mag-order ng Firmax Firmang and Lifting Cream and Immune System Booster, contact Mr. Dante Merivillas on Facebook. Cell phone number 09086553757.